hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here welcome my name is ivy and i'm a youtuber content creator and makeup artist based in asaba delta state nigeria and in today's video we're just recreating this beautiful beautiful makeup look and gisting about life about the economy about how we cannot survive we are trying so hard to survive our children of god so we must adapt we must we must get by <laughs> if you'd like to see how i got this makeup look the products i use and you want to hear a uh, scintillating gist then please keep on watching and don't forget to subscribe so guys to begin with i'm going to be priming with this Huda Beauty Matte Perfection Praise Makeup Base and then we are going to be gisting about the economy like <laughs> what is going on it seems that this is not only a Nigeria issue like it seems like this is a global matter because how can I not be able to afford my life anymore like the basic things the basic things are just so expensive oh, the weather is so hot but i had to turn off the ac because the noise the sound so difficult to edit out no matter how much you try so i just have on my my pan here so the economy what's going on what is going on why is everything so expensive like the hustle now eh, is times <laughs> almost times five <laughs> like ah my tired is tired though i'm just getting out my brushes and let's start with foundation i want to make use of this is my fenty beauty filter foundation i'm in the shade 445 this fenty beauty foundation because like this time I, I i was planning to get it this one is outside my budget too because you know it's so expensive now but thank god i already owned it before now so let's be using it first when it finishes <laughs> We we'll start looking for alternatives <laughs> because I don't think I've gotten to that stage yet. <laughs> I want to make use of this my Zaron foundation brush. I would have used the Juvia's Place one, but let's make use of this one. Okay, we're done with the blending now and I don't want the coverage to be too full so I think I'm okay with that coverage. Then we're going to make use of the Plenty Beauty Pro Filter Concealer in the shade 420. Come on, this economy, eh? Hey, sweet Jesus. <laughs> People are barely surviving, like I now have a kid. <laughs> um, baby food and pampas. Eh? Something else. How are you guys coping? What exactly is going on? Let's blend out. Just using the edge of the beauty sponge now to blend out everything so that there are no harsh lines and then we are going to set immediately like I don't know if it's showing up on camera but I'm sweating let's make use of this uh, triangular sponge I am sweating badly I am half tempted to put on this AC honestly because I don't 
don't want this makeup to start melting off my face. Okay, so I don't with that. I'm just going to go on now to draw on my brows. Let me make use of this my this beauty brow pencil. Let's just draw it on. Can you hear that? <laughs> this brow pencil is finished. make use of this and we're hearing now that the thin brows are, <laughs> are now in vogue I me mean, i don't know how i feel about that though i don't really like my brows so thin Seems like this AC is blowing hot air because <laughs> I don't even understand what's going on anymore. Anyway, for eyeshadow today, I want to make use of my um, the Balm Mid Matte Nude eyeshadow palette. And I have two Hega and Esther palettes right here, but I want to make use of the Trinity eyeshadow palette, and I want to make use of this pink right here this one I love that color so much so <sighs> back to our gist to oh, how, how are people coping because I'm not understanding and then you're looking at those entrepreneurs and they are like you know people are not selling because people are not you know buying you know um, the buyers They've, you know, everybody's just focused on feeding now. I'm used taking the matte Lombardi shade in that palette to set underneath my brow bone. If you've been following me for any number of time, you know why I do this. This is a step I never, ever, ever miss. Ah, so they are not selling and people are like focused on feeding. And then... The buyers are also scared of selling because you will just sell off your goods now and like <laughs> it's almost i'm mixing the matte gassy and matte rose and shades to blend into my crease it's almost like you go to you go to restock today and then if peradventure you finish selling whatever you have to restock that same then you go the next day the price are never the same like it has added so it's more like you know they are selling and trying to catch up like what's the price for today what's the um more hmm. this is serious i have a friend who sells cosmetics as well and you know she had a huge huge loss recently because some of her products got expired and i was like why didn't you just do a sales? And she said, if I do a sales, then that means that she's going out of business because her, her, her cost price, she won't be able to meet up. And I was like, okay, now the goods are expired. You can't sell, you can't do nothing. You don't even have anything. So what happens? She didn't even know that the goods were about to expire, you know. You know. As well, though, I'm deepening the crease with my matte wood shade. Like things are just, things are just one kind. I don't even understand what is going on anymore. What? Ah, <sighs> uh, what concealer do I? 
Let's see make use of this authentic beauty concealer bag. What's the need of holding? If you still can finish, don't wear the other. <laughs> I'm just going to take this brush and just use the concealer to serve as kind of like um, an eyeshadow base. Just apply that all over my lid. That one now lost. Market women, like basic things that you get for like cheap prices. Like, <laughs> you carry 100k to the market just to buy food stuff. And you guys know that Baku bag. They want to even get a full Baku bag. It's that bad. It is that bad. Like, God, I beg go. <laughs> People are barely barely just meeting up and everybody is so angry like any small thing <laughs> quarrel and fighting has erupted as well though. let's take that pink shadow now and apply all over the lid uh, is this pink pinking too much Ah, I feel like this pink is so pink. I'm not too comfortable with it, so I'm going to tone it down a bit with another shade. Man, how are you guys coping? How are you guys coping? The number of alternative jobs I have tried of recent eh? hmm. can't even begin to count. I have tried up work. I have tried like some of these remote jobs. So many. I'm taking a deeper shade now and I'm applying that on top of that pink just to like tone it down. Like can you see the difference between this eye and this eye? Now this one is a bit more toned down. That is how you blend out things or make correction or changes all right that is beautiful simply simply beautiful if i have my way there's only these kinds of colors and gold that those are the only kind of tutorials i'll be doing <laughs> going back in now with that matte wood shade and i don't know why of recent i've just started loving adding black i'm still going to add the black because i need more depth in this outer v and then i need a small brush i'm going to take my sigma e27 blending brush and that matte garcia shade and i'm just going to blend the inner corner of the eye here where the shimmer shade meets the crease just so that you know there is a nice blend doesn't look unblended and rough. I want it to look seamless. Seamless. That is why you need to invest in eyeshadow brushes, right? Have multiples so that you can do what needs to be done. Now I'm going to take that same pink, the pink shade we use first. I'm just going to apply it in the inner corner of the eye here just to kind of like open it up i like the pop it gives okay and then i'm going to go into this my hega and Estai magdalene eyeshadow palette i want to make use of the black shadow in this palette this one right here I want to deepen this crease. I have been loving like a very, very dark outer V of recent. I just like the smokiness it gives to the eye. So we're going to go back in now, blend into the crease, and then with our transition brush, we're going to blend out some more. All right, that is done. 
I have tried so many jobs, guys. So, so many. And nothing. Like, it's like everybody is looking for a remote job now. I don't even understand. It's well, uh, the hustle continues. In fact, I've even gone back to... I had left... I was not as... Um, what was the word now? Since I put to bed now, I have like not really been taking on makeup jobs, but no more. I've come back home. I'm doing any and everything. Let's make use of this our Zaron liquid liner. Illegal hustle law. I don't mean all those illegal hustle. Alright, having done that, there are two things that I want to do now. I'm going to take this part of my beauty sponge and dip into that my Fenty Beauty Setting Powder. I'm going to apply that right here underneath my wing liner, just to neaten up that place and just, you know, to give that sharp edge to the eyeshadow. I tried the other day I tried applying my doing my eye makeup before I did my base and oh um, <laughs> it was not giving at all so for the foreseeable future I'm going to keep on doing my base first for now at least for mascara I want to make use of this Zaron volumizing mascara since people have been complaining I'm looking for a new brand that has the kind of lashes that I like because I'm just so used to that brown beauty and I chattered a lot of lashes and they work for me I just love the style I used the Mismetics ones a while back but I don't know if it's the style I got but it was just too big and full and it didn't really suit me okay so now we're going to smoke out underneath the lower lash line. No, before we do that, I want to. <laughs> this is how we do. Forget what, what we act on camera. <laughs> Did I just do that? I learned that from my legs. Well, I'm just going to line underneath my. You're not gonna with my. I just like the uh, my water line with this black pencil. I love the look it's giving when you put a black pencil in your waterline and I've been doing glam like this kind of look you can take for weddings for birthdays for oh one bear any party 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 thing so I'm going in now with the matte wood just to smoke out underneath the lower lash line first just under immediately under that black shadow sorry the black pencil be careful so that you don't put the powder into your eyes and then I'm going to take the matte Garcia and smoke it out some more but for today we are going to still use our Van Beauty lashes because there ain't no changing that now. <laughs> so I have, um, I want to make use of this Barbie doll ones and my, of course, my Huda Beauty Dark Tone Lash Glue. I don't even know where that thing is anymore. Sweet Jesus, sweet Jesus. I'm panicking right now because I can't find my Huda Beauty. <laughs> can't find my Huda Beauty Lash Glue, the one I normally use. I just hope my kids have not done something. Ha! Ah, my gosh. Let's make use of this Younger Beauty and Lash glue like my heart is beating so fast because <laughs> <laughs> it is not in the budget oh. 
let me just prep these lashes and then we'll be back to fix them Let's put on these lashes today. Let's just dust off this big from underneath the eye. We dust off and then we pat in. We dust off and then we pat in. Please, the S is on. If I had not already said it, because if you hear that whooshing sound, it's the air conditioner. I, I just had to turn it on because. Your girl was burning up. Like this makeup was not makeup in anymore. It was. It was. <laughs> it was almost coming off. The weather is so hot. So 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 hot. So how are you guys coping now? How are you guys coping? If you have suggestions for like remote jobs that can do and you see all these channels that are doing all these get um, make two thousand dollars in 20 minutes <laughs> they've been blowing up because let's take your fenty beauty powder now to set the rest of our face oh that was so much they've been blowing up because yeah people just want to make quick bucks quick money I came across one the other day oh, and I was curious, you know, how you watch videos and you are paid, you gather points, you pick and convert to dollars and all of that. I'm all, I said, let me try you. Oh. I tried and it was rubbish. And then I was reading people's comments and it was like, okay, 80% of the time, most of those things are just not real, not true. But of course, some people will always fall victim because <laughs> you want to make money. Not me. It's my data that I wasted that pained me on watching those videos and after hours, you know, watching even though I was not even doing anything, just put those videos on and just be racking up points. At least people make one dollar. So <laughs> very funny something. Then we need to bronze now with our Fenty Beauty bronzer. Is this a Fenty Beauty? <laughs> What's going on? Why do I have everything Fenty Beauty here? Why do I have everything Fenty Beauty here? We are bronzing. This Fenty Beauty bronzer reminds me a lot of my Juvia's Place dark bronzer. Because this red, this Fenty Beauty bronzer is a bit ready but I like the warmth it gives to my face I love the warmth it gives to my face so you guys be careful out there I know that things are happening but so I don't get scammed though me while I'm looking for legit opportunities I'm also still very very careful I want to go in now with my tea bronzer in dark, mixing those two shades to serve as like a blush. Just take it up a bit. Be careful out there, oh. scammers are on the increase, trying to trying to make something for themselves because I don't get it. Then going into my deep dark, give me a split deep dark palette. I'm taking this shade up here, and then I'm going to use that to contour my nose. I can't believe I just blocked you guys. You didn't even see what I did at all. Then we're going to highlight our 
Huda Beauty 3D HD Highlighter Palette. I'm going to take this pinky shade right here. It's called Zanzibar. And I'm just going to hit that at the top of my cheekbones. Yeah, I'm not leaving this highlighter trend. I don't know what's going on in the beauty world. Like, <laughs> some people are highlighting, some people are not me. I will always be a highlighter girl. I love the subtle glow it gives. Just hit some underneath my brown bone. Just for the pop of color. I'm going to go back in now with my transition color brush just to blend out any harsh lines. I'm going to go back in now with my powder brush just to blend everything in together so that everything looks well blended. And this face is giving. I love, love, love what it's giving. And then we're going to set the face. What are we going to use to set? Let me make use of this my NYX setting spray. Okay. Now I'm just going to clean my lips and then I'm going to line the lips. So I want to make use of this my Tyrone Bold Lip Pencil. So while you guys are out there like trying to hustle, avoid all this money doubling scheme. So if it's too good to be true, it is actually too good to be true. Are there honest opportunities out there? Yes, there are. But be careful. Then I just found a bunch of Avon lipsticks. Like I never knew I had these lipsticks, brand new Avon lipsticks. So I brought I brought all of them out. They were almost twelve. Like they were at the back of my stash where I keep. Like there was just one empty nylon covering it. I was in shock. Almost twelve lipsticks. So we're back. I'm making use of this Avon ultra color lipstick and cashmere they were still brand new brand new this is like a nudie lipstick i don't know what i'm thinking red will suit this lip color more this eye color more well let's just go with this so there you have it guys, our finished look. I feel like the makeup is given and everything is on point. So even though Nigeria is happening to us and the world is happening to people in the other countries of the world, please be very careful though. Me, I have cut down, I cannot afford my lifestyle anymore. I have cut down on a whole lot of things. Even makeup purchases. <laughs> now, hmm, I'm so happy that I have a makeup stash because right now I am shopping my stash and I'm just thankful that I have like backups of stuff. So I still have some time to breathe. <laughs> but be careful out there. Or buy what you can afford. Don't go into debt just to survive because you know how debt multiplies. <laughs> All right, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for staying tuned till the end. I hope you learned a thing or two. How do you feel like this, our discourse video? Should we just discuss about things like this or juicy details? I think the next one is going to be a very juicy, juicy one because something just happened in the street after mine and I'm going to save that for our next makeup tutorial. That's what we're going to gist about. So once more, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for staying tuned till the end. And until I come your way again next week, remain blessed. Bye, guys.